in the uh, first half, uh, just not anything that uh, you wanted to write home about. But in the second half, you guys kind of settled down. And other than the free throws they got, you held them to seven field goals and I think 18 points in the second half other than those uh, last few minute free throws. Yeah, defensively was certainly a uh, tale of two halves. Really, the whole game was. But, but yeah, I, I like the way we fought. Uh, they're a really good team. They're really, really good. They're, they're veteran. They're tough. They're physical. They just pound away on your body blows all day long on the block. And I thought I thought our big guys were terrific fighting their duck ends. A Tim Bior had a great defensive game. Um, you know, they, they got us on the glass, but they're really, really big. And we, we uh, you know, I th thought, we, thought we fought the right way. Uh, and then, yeah, it was a heck of a job defensively. It was, it gave up seven field goals in the second half. One of them was again, when the game was basically over. They needed to score for the new point differential deal, which didn't matter. But I uh, uh, liked, liked the way our guys responded. It wasn't one of those timeouts where we went in there and ran, ran into the rave. We just talked to them about playing our way, playing, playing the way we're capable of, playing UTSA basketball. And, and I uh, kind of thought we would do that. I thought our focus would be doing that offensively, but really it started with our defense, which is really a good sign. Uh, talk about Javon finally getting some action, and uh, he looked uh, like the Javon of old, especially in the second half after he got his legs under him a little bit. Yeah, he really did. It wasn't, wasn't real surprising that he'd be able to come in there and give us a boost. He's been practicing at a high level. Um, you know, we're excited to have him out there. It, it, help, it helps in more ways. It, just the fact that he gets, he gets 13 points in 15 minutes. Yeah. Uh, is great, but it, it makes other guys more comfortable and, and opens up things for other people and allows us to play a little faster. So it, ha it has more effect than just, just him scoring. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Everybody seems to just play more confidently when he's on the floor. Yeah, and we, we we had a lot of the veteran guys in there together when he was on the floor, just allowed us to run some, some stuff that we've run in the past. But, yeah, he gave us a nice uh, uh, burst. Uh, I like the run we made, Adam. Cut it to 11, cut it to 9 one time. Uh, that part was good, but we just, just, we were just so, we just got whooped the first half. I mean, UC Irvine did what, everything they wanted to do, and, and we didn't respond very well in the first and, half. And Keaton had a game high for you today with a 23, I believe, and just a, a really good game for him, especially with Javon on the floor doing what he was doing in the second half. Yeah, our, 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 we're so much, we have so much better spacing when we've got those two guys out there together. You know, we're not, uh, if one of those guys is not on the floor, people are in there pretty tight. You know, they, they were in there. You see, everybody was in there pretty tight with two big, big guys in there at all times. So uh, floor spacing was better. That, that helped Keaton. We had better tempo. Of course, when Javon's on there, we, we, were, allowed to, we were able to play a little faster. So um, positive signs. We, can't, we just can't have a first half like that. Another tough game tomorrow with South Dakota State. Yeah. They were pretty good, too. Yeah, we watched that game before ours, and I thought both those teams were terrific. Tulane and South Dakota State both. Um, extremely impressed with the big guy for South Dakota State. He's an All-American candidate, legit big with incredible skill and uh, agility, and uh, he's, he's, a, he's a terrific player. He pick and pop, shoot the three, pump fakes and drives and handles the ball. He's, he's a stud. He'll be a handful, and they got a good team, you know, good, another winning culture, just like you see Irvine. These teams have, have been really, really good the last few years, South Dakota State's uh, been really good the last couple of years. They'll, they'll be a handful. All right, Steve, thanks so much, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Andy. All right.